Hello everybody, my name is John Koontz and this is Aries Adventure, a 1250 mile paddle down the Columbia River where I'll have to get around 14 dams, a U.S. border crossing, and lots of open water. Along the way, I'll be sharing my adventure with Lincoln Elementary in Oak Park, Illinois. It's an elementary school full of e eager kids to learn about adventure. For a paddler, the Columbia River creates a major challenge. It's 1,243 miles long, has 14 main stem dams, and one U.S. border crossing. All are extremely difficult for paddlers, and that's why so few have done the river. It is a major challenge, and more people have summited Mount Everest than have paddled the entire Columbia. Canal Flats, August 3rd, 2018, on John's Columbia River Trip, Harry's Adventure. Here we go. It's going to be a long trip.
Hey kids, it's John, and um, I'm just approaching uh, one of the more difficult sections of the Columbia River here. It's called Red Great Canyon, and it's uh, basically a steep wall canyon with uh, whitewater rapids in it. And the uh, question I get asked quite a bit is, aren't you afraid? And uh, I always say, of course I'm afraid. Uh, Beautiful. Incredible. That's nothing like being here in the moment right now, right before going into this canyon. See the whirlpool on the right? The water's much higher now. I mean, oh, look out. <laughs> oh man, it just is these uh, thunderclaps are shaking my teeth, they're so close, man. This is crazy. three ways to get around these Columbia River dams. The first is to walk your kayak around like I'm doing here. My kayak is balanced on a set of wheels and I'm pulling it from a rope from the front. The second way is to go through the lock. A lock is a basically a gate that allows you to get from one part of the river to the other. They're the most convenient and easiest to use. The third way is to get a ride in a vehicle around the dam times difficult. Out of the 14 main stem dams, five have locks and nine have none.
perfect day. Loving being out here on the water. It's nothing like it. Just being in the moment here. Enjoying the wind at my back, sun on my face. Clear sailing ahead. Just gotta love it. This is what I do it for. It's the big reason why I go through all the hardships to be out here to make this happen. Just be in the moment, enjoy it. This time, I'm taking Ari along with me. She's my inspiration. And uh, I call on her when I need help. And most of the time, she comes through. So, her spirit's with me. And uh, I can't really realize Diane and John your family, how important that is to me. Right now, she's at my back, giving me a little push. curriculum on the website. How cool. Pictures. They could learn more from you than they could in the school. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. I'm, well, I mean, you know, yeah. Well, my boyfriend's got some great nieces, a great niece and nephew. They live in San Francisco. Oh, yeah. <laughs> The one would rather just get on his electronics and sit all day oh, yeah. than do anything. And it's like, God, get out. It's so you go to the
little windy out here, but we'll make it work. Uh, made it to Grand Coulee. That's a big boy right there. And unfortunately, the winds up got up the last uh, half hour. I'm kind of fighting it to get to the boat ramp up here. And you kind of see it in the distance there with some cars. Uh, halfway, man. This is awesome. 608 miles. And I uh, can't believe I've made it halfway. It's an uh, incredible experience. Everybody, it's John, and this is a short little video to thank everyone for your support in the uh, Columbia River adventure. Um, I'm halfway, I'm here at Grand Coulee Dam, and uh, just so happy to be here. And it's been a great half trip so far, and I'm expecting another great half trip. Please, please, please share this with your kids, your grandkids, your neighbor kids, with teachers teachers please share it with your classrooms it's an awesome learning experience for kids and that's one of my goals and again I just thank everyone for sending the cards and the uh, letters and just uh, beautiful comments on Facebook thank you I'll keep you updated on the next half